All birds lay eggs. The eggs are where baby birds grow until they hatch. Most birds lay their eggs in nests. Take a look at this bird still standing at its nest. Why do birds build nests? Birds build nests. Number one, to protect the eggs from enemies. Two, to keep the eggs in one place so that the birds can sit on them and keep them warm. Three, to keep the eggs warm when the parent birds are away. And four, to protect the baby birds when they hatch. Did you know that some birds build their nests in holes in riverbanks and trees? Take a look at this kingfisher. It is flying to its nest in a hole in a river bank. Some birds build their nests on the ground. Take a look at this nest. It is a huge mound of soil, leaves and small sticks. Who does this nest belong to? It belongs to a bird called the Malee Fowl. Many birds build their nests in trees. This bird is called a song thrush. Where is it standing? Yes, it is standing at its nest. The nest is made of dried grass and it is lined with mud. If you look at a hummingbird's nest, you will notice that it is very tiny. The hummingbird's nest is made from cobwebs and moss. The weaver bird, on the other hand, weaves a nest using strips of leaves. The long tunnel helps to protect the eggs and the baby birds from any snakes. Now that is clever indeed. Some birds do not build nests. For example, the emperor penguin lives in the Antarctic. Why doesn't he build a nest? It does not build a nest because there are no sticks or plants to make the nest. The female penguin lays one egg. The male then puts it on his feet and tucks it under his feathers to keep it warm. Many cuckoos do not build nests either. The female lays her eggs in the nests of other birds. Can you spot the cuckoo's egg in this fig bird's nest? The cool cuckoo's egg is pink. It is the same size and shape as the fig bird's eggs. Different birds build different nests depending on where they live. The woodpecker builds its nest in a hole in a tree. The kiwi cannot fly, so it builds its nest on the ground beneath the tree roots. The grebe is a water bird. It builds its nest in the water using weeds. The tailor bird makes its nest by sewing together two leaves with plant fibers. How do birds make a nest? Birds make their nests out of different materials. Most birds make their nests out of sticks and twigs. Some birds, like crows, use metal foil 
pieces of string and paper in their nest. Birds will line their nest with feathers, animal fur, grass and leaves or even mud. Let's talk about the eggs. Look at the shape of a hen's egg. Many birds lay eggs that are this shape. Some birds lay eggs of a different shape. Take a look at a guillemot's egg. A guillemot's egg is a very strange shape. Guillemots live on narrow cliff ledges. They do not build a nest. The female lays one egg that is pear-shaped. Why? So that it will not roll off the ledge. Some birds lay colored eggs. Birds that nest on the ground, such as the fairy tern, lay speckled green or brown eggs. This makes it hard for the bird's enemies to see the eggs. Hatching It takes a lot of time and hard work for a baby bird like a duckling to hatch. Before it hatches, the duckling turns so that its beak points towards the round end of the egg where there is an air space. The duckling needs to reach the air to breathe. Then the duckling breaks through the shell using its egg tooth. The egg tooth is a sharp bump on the duckling's beak. It falls off after the duckling hatches. The duckling cuts a circle all around the shell. The duckling then pushes the shell apart and tumbles out. The duckling has hatched. Baby birds Take a look at these song thrush chicks. They are born very helpless. They grow very quickly in the nest. When they hatch, song thrush baby birds have no feathers. Their eyes are not open. Look at these thrush baby birds. They are begging for food from their parents. They have brightly colored mouths so that their parents can see them. They have small feathers. Look at these nine-day-old song thrush baby birds. They are growing feathers. Look at these song thrush baby birds. They are 13 days old and they are covered with feathers. They are fledged. Fledged means that it has wing feathers that is large enough for them to be able to fly. The baby birds will leave the nest in the next five days. Look at these baby birds. They are covered with soft, fluffy down feathers when they hatch. Their eyes are open and they can find food for themselves. These chicks will be able to fly in two weeks. 